Good news, the long wait for a new update to Grand Theft Auto Online is over. The Diamond Casino Resort is coming Tuesday, not Thursday, Tuesday, July 23rd. So I guess Rockstar's just moving around event weeks for everybody. Like, all right, well, Red Dead Online, we're, we're, we're going to put you at Tuesday. No, 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 we're just going to bump you out of the way and, and put Grand Theft Auto Online back on Tuesdays. I guess that's what they're doing. I don't know. But anyways... There is a trailer. I will link it below in the description section along with this newswire. Feel free to let me know your thoughts, your views, and opinions about the Diamond Casino Resort below in the comment section. So we're going to go over the trailer. I've watched it a few times, and I'm just going to do like a fast reaction to it. I'm going to have the audio off because I don't want Eddie Murphy uh, giving me a, a copyright claim. So we don't want that to happen. All right, so anyways, here we go. Roulette table, poker... Slot machines, they're rebuilding completely the uh, Diamond Resort Casino. So, change the logo a little bit. Mr. Chang from Grand Theft Auto V. Younger Chang. His dad is not around anymore. So, it looks like arcade games, slot machines. This looks like the antagonist here. Horse racing, I don't think there's actually going to be horses. Some blonde chick want us to destroy the casino. Let's see. I think that's... I believe that's Brucey. Sounds like Brucey. Looks like an older version of Brucey. So that's probably Brucey. I'm willing to bet that that's Brucey. Gee. Uh, some uh, guy giving us champagne, explosions, and uh, the Diamond Resort Casino. Okay, coming this uh, July 23rd. Like I said, if you want to watch it yourself, it is linked below in the description section. Feel free and let me know if I missed anything. I know that was a fast reaction. But at the same time, I don't want Eddie Murphy to uh, come after me. He likes to party all the time, but he also might end up copyright claiming all the time as well. And he probably needs it because his like, really good movies were back in the 80s, right? He may have had a good one or two films in the 90s, but anyways, like I said, I love Eddie Murphy, but I don't want a copyright claim from him. Opening soon, the massive construction project on the corner of a Vinewood Drive, Mirror Park Boulevard, is nearing completion, radically changing the skyline of Los Santos forever. When the brand new Diamond Casino Resort opens its doors, one and all are welcome inside to play or just stay in the most luxurious residence in the entire state. More than just a place to go and let your ambitions and your sense of passing the time, uh, the Diamond is the one-stop destination for quality entertainment high-end living, and a range of experiences you won't find anywhere else. So yes, they have completely changed the look, the exterior of the casino that we've grown to know and love over the past five years, as you can tell. It's a little different now. The casino itself, if you're looking to dive into the action, the casino floor has a selection of activities to enjoy, Play against the house using chips in three-card poker. So this isn't the same kind of poker we have in Red Dead Online. That's Texas Hold'em poker. This is three-card poker. poker. So we'll be checking that out Tuesday. And I'll probably do some uh, three-card poker videos similar to what I've been doing with the Red Dead Online poker series. By the way, episode five tomorrow on the channel. We're going to Tumbleweed. Uh, Blackjack. So Blackjack is coming to Grand Theft Auto Online along with the roulette table. Slot machines with a variety of prizes are also at your fingertips, while Inside Track offers a lounge to watch and cheer along with friends as the drama of virtual horse racing unfolds. I wonder how that's going to work, because it's virtual horse racing, and there's not going to actually be horse racing on the horse track in the game, so I don't think they're adding horses to Grand Theft Auto Online, although that's been a theory and a speculation and a kind of a running joke for years ever since I started the channel back in 2014, but I don't think we actually have horses in Grand Theft Auto Online. If you want horses, there's another game you can go play. So part of my concern is like with Red Dead Online, there are several countries, including Puerto Rico, that can't play poker. So I wonder if this is gonna be the same problem in Grand Theft Auto Online when it comes to the gambling in the game, like uh, three card poker, blackjack, roulette, slots, along with the inside track, or maybe Rockstar has a way around that. I guess we'll find out on Tuesday, because if the same issue rises, then there's going to be a lot of countries, a lot of people that are once again going to miss out on a huge chunk of the new uh, activities in this update, which would be very unfortunate. 
Spin the lucky wheel in the lobby for chips, cash, and clothing, or even the new Trafaid Thrax. We'll show that off in a moment. A new supercar can be found whirling in the podium during the opening week. And be sure to check Pat each week to see what new high-end vehicle can be won. So I guess each week there's going to be like a new high-end vehicle. Probably not new. They'll probably just be throwing out vacas and, and adders and, you know, and furnaces. <laughs> oh, win a vaca. Yay. Hey, va vaca's still a sexy car, okay? All right, so guests looking to push the limits of high-end resort fashion can also choose from carefully curated rotation of new clothing and accessories at the clo casino store. So I think the new uh, clothing coming to the game will be found at the casino store. Now, I mentioned this a few weeks ago that... A lot of casinos have a lot of things in it, like not just gambling, not just hotels, but they also have restaurants, bars, and shops and stores. The same thing can be said for the diamond. Okay, so sitting on top of the diamond is an oasis for those luxury shopping for lavish lane property in which uh, to entertain friends. The master penthouse sits beside the roof terrace with the infinity pool and stunning views. <laughs> the infinity pool. <laughs> Yeah, let's chill in the infinity pool while we get griefed by broomsticks and orbital cannons. Uh, we'll see how well that goes down Tuesday, right? By the way, I will be streaming that early in the morning on Tuesday. I hope you'll join me. I see the roof terrace of the infinity pool and the stunning views and, and titles of the owner to the VIP membership status, including access to the VIP lounges, high limit tables, plus range of special services via the penthouse uh, phone, including aircraft limousine services and more. Renovate your residence with several upgradable floor plans, including a private spa with a round-the-clock personal stylist, bar and party area perfect for hosting raging member parties, and featuring private retro arcade games. So that's where you're going to be able to play the arcade games. Probably a lot of the older uh, Grand Theft Auto quote-unquote video games that they've had in their previous installments. Games within games, right? It's all <laughs> Inception. That's the word I was looking for. So, bar and party area, perfect for hosts and raging member parties, retro arcade games, media room to enjoy games of uh, Don't Cross the Line, and contemporary Vinewood cinema like Meltdown, uh, Loneliest Robot in Great Britain. Same crap that we've already had, okay? Like, <laughs> we already have Don't Cross the Line. We already have Meltdown and Loneliest Robot in Great Britain in the theaters that randomly pop up. As an owner, you can select uh, the penthouse's color palette, and patterns and uh, cement a, a place among uh, the LS Norve Rich in order to uh, range the modern art of the casino store from refined uh, to pop art, daring modern culture, along well, sculpture, not culture, sculpture, culture. I can't rhyme to save my life. And that can all be moved from place to place around your property. Okay, so you're actually not only going to have interiors to choose from, like typical properties. But it looks like there's going to be some things you actually can move around for once. That'll be interesting to see how that works. I mean, it'll probably be limited, right? There'll probably be like three or four different places you can put a sculpture or you can put a painting or blah, blah, blah. With the Master Penthouse, you'll also become a member of the Diamond family. And the business uh, needs your attention. Help property owner Tao Chang and the Diamond staff protect their investment from the clutches of a corrupt family of Texan petrochemical magnets in a series of all-new cooperative missions. Why are you hating on Texans for? How dare you? It's so crazy that Texas actually does exist in Grand Theft Auto because, like, one of the, uh, I know I'm going off topic. I apologize. But there is, like, a, one of the websites that you can put up on your phone that talks about Texas. I forgot which website it was. But, yeah, Texas is actually a thing in Grand Theft Auto. Man, hating on Texas. Boo. Obviously, I'm from Texas and Louisiana. Each mission pays out special awards for the first time uh, completion and hosting entire story thread. We'll reward you with highly coveted brand new vehicle free of charge. You can also pick up additional work and odd jobs to earn extra cash and chips with a quick phone call from the Diamond's head of operations, Agatha Baker. Okay, so wait a minute. Wait a minute. Let me, go, let me back up real quick. Okay, so first time completion, hosting the entire story thread will reward you with a highly coveted brand new vehicle free of charge. So are these kind of like heists or something or a variation of heists? Probably with the similar heist mechanics, but they're not technically heists. You're helping out uh, young Chang, Chang Jr. with uh, his casino. Uh, see, I thought the ballers were going to be the owners. I'm kind of disappointed. 
<laughs> and some of us actually wanted Michael DeSanta to be involved in it somehow. But I guess we have Brucey as a guest. Um, that's what I'm guessing from the trailer. But uh, for all of you involved uh, with the uh, Twitch Prime and uh, Rockstar Social Club link-ups, today's the last day to do that in order to uh, get the uh, bonuses like uh, you know, $1.25 million dollars. Uh, 15% extra money off of uh, purchase of shark cards. Plus, you're going to be able to purchase the Master Penthouse for free in the Diamond Casino and Resort. Now, this is probably like the, the base model you'll be able to get for free. Like all the upgrades, all the customization. Well, that's probably going to cost money. So, some of you already know about uh, the link up that you have to do between Twitch Prime. As long as you have Amazon Prime, you also have Twitch Prime. And link it up to your Rockstar Social Club to get rewards for both Grand Theft Auto Online and Red Dead Online. And here is the new supercar, the Thrax. And if I'm going to do a price prediction really quick, I'm going to say $3 million. What say you? My prediction is $3 million, probably, at the very least. So it is interesting that with the, the Twitch Prime benefits... Those of us that have Twitch Prime linked to our Rockstar Social Club, we get a free master penthouse, which probably won't be cheap for everyone else. So I imagine all, all the upgrades and the customization, that's where the money starts to stack up. And the, getting the free car of charge for uh, first-time completion. So it's only like a one-time thing. So first-time completion hosting of the entire story thread will award you with a highly coveted brand new vehicle. So everyone's going to be taking turns hosting it, right? So you'll have to host it uh, start to finish. And then once you complete it, you get a brand new vehicle free of charge. Doesn't say which vehicle. I, I, I doubt it's the Thrax. <laughs> It'll probably be a Pinto or a new Fagio, right? <laughs> uh, I don't know. And uh, Agatha Baker. One of Agatha's the blonde chick that we saw in the trailer. I really don't know. But we know we know what the antagonist is, the, the Texan with, this, with the cowboy hat. Okay, we're not done yet. We're not done. <laughs> So, uh, first off, thanks to Akari in our Discord for posting this real quick. Right before I started working on the first half of the video, this is going to be the second half of this video. So, it's going to be a little bit longer than planned. There's actually a website, thediamondcasinoresort.com. This will also be linked below in the description section, which could very well have a bit more information. Maybe some of it is exactly the same as it was in the, the previous uh, article. So, let's look at this real quick. You've heard the rumors, you want to believe them, and there's only one way to find out. Abandon your preconceptions, let go of your inhibitions, your doubts, your sense of portion, your credit rating. <laughs> hey, I've got a good credit rating. Uh, the rumors didn't begin to do it justice. Welcome to the Diamond. Grand opening, July 23rd. Membership. So, Diamond Resort Casino. The Diamond is everyone's playground. Invest in a standard membership today. And you'll be a lifelong partner in our project to a meaningful raise the standard of living for 1%. VIP membership at the Diamond. There are members, and then there are members. And if you want to be the latter, <laughs> your uh, penthouse key away from uh, enjoying the kind of status that only uh, systematic elitists can provide. I always love the writing. All right, so experience... Uh, uh, the, the I cannot talk. The parking garage. Well, yeah, wow, wow, we have a parking garage. What a surprise. I didn't see that coming. This is not merely a garage. It's not merely a maximum security. Uh, the subterranean storage unit. Uh, think of it as an air-conditioned, custom-built, expertly a curated museum where our clients can admire each other's collections in peace and quiet. So, Fun and W2, and this is something else that they mentioned in, in our Discord. By the way, you're welcome to join our awesome Discord community below in the description section as well is that apparently people that love doing the car shows are going to be able to do car shows in this parking garage without fear of the cops are being griefed by players with uh, explosives rpgs or the broomsticks or the orbital cannons so good news for all of you that love doing the car shows in grand theft auto online this is going to be the the perfect place to do it plus you're not going to worry about the weather right because sometimes you're trying to do a car show, it starts raining, or you're about to do the car show, and it's dark, and you have to wait till it's dawn. So, inside, there's constant, the same lighting, it's all good. Good quality, so, that's excellent. Alright, so, the valet, uh, step out our front door, right into your front seat. Our valets are available 24-7, and are trained to never look 
uh, in the trunk. <laughs> never to open the glove compartment and never ask questions. Well, that's good. And that's another thing that casinos obviously have in real life is the valets. So here we go. What do we got here? Uh, the champagne service, our client code of conduct states that if any member is seen ordering a bottle of our finest champagne, spraying half all over the most exclusive clientele in the state and drowning the rest straight from the bottle, our security teams are obliged to loudly applaud. So they're bringing over the, the same wine bottle, that the expensive ass wine bottle, our champagne bottle different beverages there from uh what after uh yeah after hours so they're bringing that over <laughs> yay something else to throw your money away on i don't think i'll bother let's see aircraft concierge going up let our concierge service take care of your pre-flight checks so you can step right into the cockpit and be ready for takeoff so i guess similar to the executive office you'll have your own helipad at the diamond casino and you can just, very similar to the uh, office, the executive office, just call up one of your helicopters. And that looks like a, is that a new variation? Is that a new helicopter? I don't think that's, is that the Swift? That doesn't, maybe it's a newer helicopter. Or maybe it's not. <laughs> if it's a new helicopter, let me know. I see, I'm sure there will be new helicopters and other new stuff, including the Thrax that we went over a moment ago. Cleaning service. We recruit our housekeepers from the most uh, respected crime scene cleanup teams in the state. There is no uh, bodily fluid or potentially infectious material that they can't remove in time. It takes you to find an alibi. <laughs> okay. Awesome. Let's see, next. Uh, limousine service. Leaving the diamond can be a traumatic experience. But we know how to cushion the blow. Our resident guests can order a diamond limousine to take them amongst anywhere in the state free of charge. Yeah, but people are going to be using their supercars. I mean, I don't... I see people doing this one time, and then they're going to be like, that's okay, I'm good. I mean, unless it's like a fast travel, like where it just fast travels you to a clothing store, or fast travels you to your, your biker businesses, or your nightclub, or your bunker, or your facility... That's the only way I could see this actually working properly, but I doubt it. I mean, especially since it's free of charge. I mean, they would do similar to what they did in, what, Reddit Online with Fast Travel. They would charge you money. Let's see, members party. Why go to the party when the party can come to you if you're one of our residents, members? You only need to click your fingers and we'll provide the drinks, the music, and dozens of close personal friends. Oh, but I don't have any friends. <laughs> I guess friends will be provided. VIP lounge, available exclusively to our resident members. This is our inner sanctum of indulgence, the apex of affluence, and the pinnacle of privilege. The high point of high society. All right, next. Okay, okay we're at the bottom here. High limit tables, welcome to the grown-up table. Let's see. Resident guests are entitled to play in our high limit suites. Okay, cool. So there's slot machines. And I guess this is where the elite of the elite get to go play. It's not on the ground floor. Higher stakes, as they say. All right, so next, the penthouse. So let's go look at the penthouse real quick. The penthouse at the Diamond is not just a place. It's your palace. If you want a private spa, you can have it. Uh, home cinema, consider it done. Your own personal bar, private arcade cabinets. Arcade cabinets for the win. And office space. Uh, see, office. See, I wonder if the office you're going to get inside the penthouse will link to all the other office spaces. See, that would be very convenient, right? So you no longer had to go to the executive office or to the biker clubhouse or to the nightclub. You get the idea. Just say one word. Diamond. I see the master bedroom. <laughs> what? What? What's with that couch? Like what? You're gonna be put on a little show? <laughs> are you, are you gonna, you're going to watch a show? At, never mind. Uh, chic silks, fresh air bottle uh, on the summit of Mount Chiliad. Mount Chiliad is nowhere near the casino. <laughs> Round the clock access to the greatest roof terrace since Los Santos. So that's when you can tell someone's been playing this game too long is when you know exactly where things are, where things aren't. Mount Chiliad's up by Polito Bay, Rockstar. That's a different mountain. It's I forgot what the name of that mountain is. Because there's Mount Chiliad, there's Mount Gordo. There's like two other mountains. <laughs> all right. All right. Spare bedroom. Okay, we have... Uh, let's see, we all have that one friend with a spare bedroom. They'll have somewhere to crash that isn't your bidet. <laughs> oh, we have bidets now, so I guess I don't have to buy TP anymore. But I'm, I'm so used to using that. 
uh, with access to their personal wardrobe, they won't have to keep borrowing your clothes. So that's similar to the yacht, right? The yacht has that. So it looks like they're just, they're just taking mechanics that they've built for previous things and mixing it and matching it into the casino. I mean, I'm not trying to critique it, but I'm, I'm just pointing that out. I uh, see the spa room. This is well similar once again to the yacht. The yacht has a spa, but the difference is this spa will be inside. Your private spa comes with a round-the-clock personal stylist, a hot tub infused with the exact uh, jube joba. I have no idea what the hell that is. Uh, uh, okay, so let's just uh, move on, shall we? And let's see, what is this? The bar and party area. Why go to a nightclub when a nightclub can come to you? So here's another thing. See, they're, they're once again borrowing from something that they've already put in the game, a.k.a. the nightclub, which is now dead because its popularity is at zero. Poor Laszlo's just crying into the couch, and Tony's like, I guess I'll go back to Liberty City. The most exclusive venue in town is the one where, you can, uh, where you're can, where you in charge of the guest list. <laughs> Maybe Laszlo will have a cameo, and you'll see him crying in the corner. But that this is an interesting-looking game. What is it? Oh, that, I think that's what crossed the line. I think that's crossed the line, which is already in the game. So, uh, see, let's see. What game is this? Uh, start Crime Gang Wars. Okay. Oh, that's a different game. I'll be interested to see if this is a brand new game or is it an older game. All right, time to dig out the high-waisted jeans and fluorescent headband. Diamond Casinos have the exclusive rights to classic arcade games, Invade, Persuade 2, Street Crime, Gang Wars Edition. So those are the three games that we're going to see in uh, the arcade games. I wish they would bring, like, Cubed and a couple of the other classics from previous Grand Theft Autos because I liked some of them. Those were kind of fun. All right, so here's the office. Okay, so sometimes you need to take care of your affairs, but there's no reason you should have to leave the lap of the luxury to do it. All of our offices come with the gun locker and hidden safe as standard. So, once again, I ask the question, is this office specifically just for Diamond Casino stuff that we're going to get? Or are we also going to be able to do everything else from all the other offices and businesses and properties throughout the game? Because it, it would be a lot more convenient if we had the ability to do that. I'm just saying. All right, so here's the uh, penthouse garage. Home doesn't just feel like a home unless you have 10 hypercars in a well-guarded basement. So are they implying that it's only a 10-car garage or is it several levels? Like similar to the executive garage and the nightclub uh, garage where you can buy like several levels of it. I think uh, what the Arena War garage is like that as well. Of course, I don't have any other additional levels. Let's see, so I guess there's going to be like multiple levels you can purchase, and each one's going to have 10 cars in it, I'm guessing. All right, lounge area. Your lounge features a bar and dining facilities as standard and enables you to add five other extensions to your suite. Okay. Experience appliances. Never again will you have to suppress your gag reflexes as you rub shoulders with general public in the cinema. In addition, you'll be free to enjoy Don't Cross the Line on the big screen with friends. So Don't Cross the Line, that game will be on your TV, but the arcades will have different games. Okay, you know what would be funny? If they actually put the original Grand Theft Auto game in the arcade, I would totally buy that, and I would totally do a live stream playing just the original 90s OG Grand Theft Auto. Rockstar, make it happen. Let's see, artwork here at the Diamond. We understand that, uh, see, far from uh, vicious, uh, pretentious uh, garbage, contemporary Americana art, one of the most important systems of money laundering is developed in the world. Make your penthouse the center for one of our finest cultural institutions today. Yeah, I'm sure my uh, luxury apartment will, will look really awesome. It's, it's probably going to be as bare bones as possible because I'm cheap. Right, we'll see how that goes with the artwork. Okay, so let's see. Uh, the next category is the casino itself. All right, so this is... I'm surprised by this uh, faux website. Once again, all this link below in the description section of the Newswire and the Diamond Casino's official website. The casino, here your dreams are reality, and your reality is a dream. Here, every whim can be satisfied, every fantasy fulfilled, no impulse control, no windows, no clocks, no uh, clearly labeled exits... <laughs> Welcome to the Diamond Standard. So this is what I'm really excited about, the casino. Table games. Don't be fooled. Roulette, blackjack, poker at the Diamond. Once again, it's three-card uh, poker, by the way, specifically, because there's different types of poker games. These aren't games. Every uh, card dealt, every spin of the wheel, every polished quip, every gasp of the crowd, every 
delusional grandeur. This is art. And a good way to take your money. So that's another thing I'm wondering. Is the chips going to be a new monetary system in the game? Because obviously gambling is kind of illegal in some countries. Well, online gambling. And I was curious about how Rockstar was going to come up with a workaround for gambling in uh, Grand Theft Auto Online. I guess we'll find out Tuesday. All right. So slot machines. Yes, they're adding slot machines. And by the way, uh, the age-old rule when it comes to uh, casinos, the house always wins. That's why I prefer just playing poker. And plus, I like poker. Let's see. Here at the Diamond, we understand that the fine art of slot machines, we recognize split-second reflexes, years of research and training, rock-solid intuition, and the towering IQ that make a true master. That's right. We've been waiting for you. They've been waiting to take your money, <laughs> honey. <laughs> All right. So Inside Track. So this is the one that's going to be interesting. How is Inside Track going to work? Horse racing is the sport of kings, and Inside Track... Is the only way to experience it, the drama, the ma the majesty, the excitement, the perfectly simulated aroma of freshly cut turf and hot manure. <laughs> All about leaving the comfort of the bespoke air-conditioned suite. So, inside track, it's they said in the newswire it was virtual horse racing. And they had to put a lot of time into this because a pattern would start to emerge in, over time. And you'd be able to quickly determine, like, okay, this is going to be this race, or this is going to be that race, so you know who's going to win. And, uh... I don't know how that's going to work, to be honest, the virtual horse racing. Eventually, people are going to see a pattern, and they're going to take advantage of it. You know what would be funny? If they took, like, actual horse racing in uh, Red Dead Online, even though I hate it because I don't like being shot when I'm trying to win a race, and they actually implemented that into uh, Inside Track, and you could actually watch people race in Red Dead Online, and at the beginning of the race, you would bet on who you think is going to win the race. That would be funny, but I don't think that's going to happen. Just a thought. Lucky Will. Some people have the fortune favors the brave here at the Diamond. We're rather, uh, we'd rather say that Destiny favors those with a full membership. Spin the Will once a day, and you're guaranteed a massive uh, close of self-importance every time. So we'll look at the Will real quick. There's going to be a vehicle. I guess that's the, the big thing, so your chance to win a vehicle. It doesn't mean it's going to be a good vehicle. It could be crap. I think the Thrax will actually be available the first week. But a lot of people are going to want to drive the, the Thrax right away. And so they're banking on people just buying the Thrax instead of the chance of winning it, which probably is very slim. You have probably have a very slim chance of winning the Thrax, just like in real-life gambling and giveaways and contests. Uh, another option is uh, fifty thousand uh, dollars clothing. Uh, see, let's see some money. Okay, yeah. There's also a chip option. So there's a chip icon now in the game. So the chip icon will be for chips, and I guess that there's going to be a separation of like money, money, and chip currency so the chip currency is going to be for all the gambling so you're going to be able to get uh, chips on the wheel you're going to be able to get money on the wheel you're going to be able to get discounts as well as clothing rp yes because i really need rp with all my rank hundred something characters thank you rockstar very cool there's also a mystery <laughs> i wonder what the mystery one's going to be about that's going to be interesting. So, yeah. Uh, once again, they're borrowing this over from uh, the Spin the Wheel in Arena Wars. So, yeah. I'm just pointing out a fact. And finally, the Casino Store. All right. So, let's check out the Casino Store. Looks very, very similar to another store in the game, doesn't it? Yeah. Exclusive fashion, unique design, artwork. Uh, here are some things in life that money can't buy. But don't fret. Our in-house store offers a rotating selection of tastefully curated items that can be purchased with chips. So, are these items actually going to be where you have to, like, have chips to buy them? I mean, you can't spend money? Yellow dog with a cone. That's art. Anti Poppy. Oh, I may have to have, have to have Poppy on my wall. I like I like old Poppy. I like her a lot. My gold collection, silver watcher. Okay, so that's it. For, that's it for now. Okay, so that that's basically it on this section. So I'm curious about the store. So you think that we'd actually be able to purchase clothing in the store? Or are we going to be able to, like, here's another idea, right? Because at a casino, before you, you sit down to play the slots or roulette table or poker, you actually have to exchange real money for the chips, and maybe that's how they're going to get around it, right? So if you want to buy, like, things from the store, then you have to, like, put up some money 
for like chip packages, like ten thousand dollars worth of chips, or a hundred thousand dollars worth of chips, or a million dollars worth of chips, and then you can go into the casino store and you can purchase the uh, the clothing that they're going to have in the casino store. So I'm guessing that they're phasing out the actual clothing stores in the game, because I mean, there's a ton of clothing already there from over five years worth of content, and maybe they're trying to to streamline it a little bit. I don't know. That's just my thought. So, anyways. That's uh, everything off the website, the DiamondCasinoResort.com website. Home, membership, penthouses, casino, casino store. That's linked below in the description section, along with the newswire we went over at the beginning of this video. I apologize that this was a, a long video, but I hope you guys enjoyed it. I hope you found it informative. And once again, are you excited for the casino? I'm just happy that we finally have new content coming to the game. It's been a while. The last thing we got was the Devastate 8 several months ago. That was the last drip-fed thing from uh, Arena Wars. And, yeah, I'm looking forward to this. And, once again, the casino is coming this Tuesday. Diamond Casino Resort Grand Opening, Tuesday, July 23rd. Going to be probably early in the morning my time, so I'll be rolling out of bed, getting up, firing up a live stream early in the morning, and we're going to check out the brand new diamond casino and resort hopefully you will join me and once again i want to know your thoughts your views your opinions about the newest update to grand theft auto online the diamond casino and resort let me know below in the comments section